Okay, hello everyone, and welcome back here to Fading Hearts. We're just about to go on a date with Rena. Oh! Um, yes. <laughs> so I'm here with the uh, the lovely ex Sim Sugar. Hello, guys. Say hello. And Sims 3 Symbiote, who hasn't called me nasty names in her video, so I'm going to be nicer to her this week. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> what? I didn't call you nasty names before. Yes, precisely. That's why I'm going to be nice to you. <laughs> so Laura gets lovely, and I get April wasn't mean to me, so here she is. <laughs> yeah, April keeps something on me. <laughs> it's just it's just secret bullying. You guys don't see it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I well, like they it. pick on me. They they pick on me terribly. Guys. <laughs> yeah. We let him, we let him <laughs> from the chains a few days a week. Um, to live streams one of them. <laughs> yeah, let's just, let's just say I, I, I sympathise with Sydney. So. <laughs> Sydney? <laughs> Don't cast aspersions on my dog ownership. <laughs> Don't touch the dog, well, Simon. Don't touch No, no, no. Sydney, Sydney's a Pomeranian. <laughs> By very definition, they're all going... You just don't understand me. <laughs> you just don't understand what it's like to be this small and fluffy. <laughs> yes, life is very difficult as a Pomeranian. <laughs> Absolutely. Anyway. Anyway. Well, that's our 20 minutes up, guys. I hope you enjoyed this. <laughs> Bye, guys. <laughs> Bye. 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 I'm trying to see what those pictures are of on his wall. Uh, I, they're pictures of yeah, the pictures are blurs as far as I see. I can a see. monkey riding a dinosaur. Yeah, I see a like a black poodle hugging a melon on a stuffed body, and the moon as a superhero riding a moped. <laughs> it's funny. I see a little silhouette of a man. Scaramouche, when you do the fandango. <laughs> Comment below, guys, and let us know what you see in those pictures. <laughs> yes. Right, should we actually start? <laughs> yes. Uh, I'm just trying to avoid this voice. <laughs> <laughs> you ready for it, Laura? Oh, it's the date with Rena. I hope you got your vocal cords tuned. <laughs> Today, I'll be going on my first date with Rena. Even though we spent so much time together before, I'm actually kind of nervous. I take a quick shower, get changed, and put on some deodorant. Thank God. At least I got it the right way around this time. <laughs> Alright, it's time to meet Rena at the park. Unfortunately, we didn't say which. I grab my keys, lock the door, and head out. Wow, how did I do that? Normally, I head out and then lock the door. <laughs> The walk to the park is pleasant. I stand there admiring the view and thinking, great, they found a second use of the graphics on the title screen. <laughs> the temperature's just right, and several fluffy white clouds dot the azure sky. The morning forecast has been a warning about the approaching storm, but so far there's no sign of it. It's hiding behind a tree. The weather's perfect <laughs> for a date. You can't stay here. We're having a date, <laughs> aren't we, Tallulah? <laughs> Yes, Damien. <laughs> when I arrive, the park is mostly empty. I can see only a few kids playing around here and there. Ryu, hi! <laughs> hi, Irina. I see you're wearing the same dress as yesterday. <laughs> Rina's so happy right now. It looks like she might flow away from sheer bliss. Like hat for himself? <laughs> Let's walk by the river! She takes my hand and leads me to the walkway by the riverside. Down by the riverside. <laughs> Her hand feels warm and silky soft. I can feel it trembling with excitement. Or is that mine? Aww. You know, I've wanted to do this with you for such a long time. Really? For how long? A long time! <laughs> She smiles at me. That's a secret. I'll never tell you. You just did. <laughs> oh, why not? <laughs> I think it's... 
I think a little. Oh, no, that's your line. <laughs> you swapped around. It's confused me. Ah! No, we are Simon stealing of lines. <laughs> I think a little. No, I just borrowed. <laughs> I think a little mystery is romantic. I mean, seriously, I clean them and put them back exactly where they were and everything. <laughs> really? And why is that? Hmm. I don't know. Maybe because not knowing makes your heart beat faster. <laughs> so does me standing behind you. <laughs> Her grip on my hand tightens. Say, Ryu? Ryu. <laughs> If I ever feel like I can make it anymore, what? Can I lean on you for support? Oh, is she moe? She's so moe. Um, yeah. Well, I thought that 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 was pretty obvious from the start. To be honest with you, <laughs> oh no, I always thought that she was just like you know really sweet and cute. I didn't realize that she was moe. Mm. She looks at me pleading with her deep, deep eyes. <laughs> will you so promise cool. me that if I can't go on will you help get me back on my feet no matter what as long as you give up the, the alcohol now <laughs> absolutely <laughs> I think we've got to say of course here haven't we yeah, yeah, big really uh, yeah. yes we lie we say of course <laughs> of course Rena <laughs> I always want to be here for you everywhere else you're on your own <laughs> You have a, such a pure and honest smile. I don't ever want to see you stop smiling. She's not smiling now. You're not smiling now, <laughs> dammit! Smile! Thank you, Ryu. I believe that even if something really awful happens, it can still lead to something good. <laughs> We're both orphans from the same disaster, but because of it, I think our hearts are connected since we felt the same sadness. <laughs> then there's those were in no way ominous words, were they? <laughs> we already share a past together, and I hope that we can share a future together, too. <laughs> Rena's words are genuine ones from the bottom of a heart or the heart of a bottom. I can never tell the difference. <laughs> and hearing them makes my heart swell with feelings for her. No matter what happens, I feel that I want to protect her forever. Aww. <laughs> oh my god, I'm not going to be able to say that. I'll give it a go. You probably already know, but this river is one of the three tributaries <laughs> of the Saka Sakru Sakuragawa. <laughs> Sakuragawa. Right, the Trident City. <laughs> she steps back, she runs up, she leaps, she clears the word. <laughs> And seeing as I'm, I'm doing a series, it's got it's full of Russian names. I feel your pain. <laughs> I got a comment the other day uh, from a, a, one of my Russian viewers saying, "My God, you got it right! I got one of them <laughs> right, <awesome>. folks." <laughs> <laughs> this particular branch has a legend about it, though. It's called the Yumini River because it has the power to change dreams into reality. Step away from the river. <laughs> Depends on your dream. <laughs> if, you... <laughs> if your heart is shining as brightly as the sun reflected on the Yumini River, then your dream will come true. At least that's how the story goes. I mean, seriously, look at her, okay? <laughs> that's someone whose dreams are going to involve pink horses. Step away from the river. <laughs> oh, I don't think so. Sometimes the cute one's dreams <laughs> can definitely not be pink horses. <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> Always the least expected ones. <laughs> <laughs> you really are a romantic person. And Laura has depth to her. I didn't <laughs> understand to this point. Oh, yes, Did you want does. to come here because of that? <laughs> I don't really have to say it, do I? <laughs> I think I'm going to have to just walk up behind Chris and say, You've been a very naughty boy. <laughs> and just see what he does. <laughs> Uh, no. <laughs> I'll tell you later. <laughs> Though it's not like I really believe in superstitions. Rena grabs my arm and pulls me close. Mm, boobies. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Hers are not bad size. They're not Ellen size, but they're not bad. <laughs> well, she herself is roughly one Ellen breast. I mean, let's be honest here. <laughs> 
I'm still happy my dream came true, though. I smile back at her and wrap my other arm around her small body. The scent of her shampoo fills my nostrils. <laughs> it's understated, but clear and sweet. Just like Rena herself. Pardon me, need to <laughs> no. <laughs> then why don't you think the, why don't you thank the river for making your dream come true? <laughs> Jumps in the river. <laughs> <laughs> he just chucks her in. <laughs> Skinny dip. <laughs> <laughs> Rena slowly releases my arm and takes a step back. Then runs. There's a jump. There's a splash. <laughs> I'm sorry, Ryu, but I just remembered something I have to go do right now. <laughs> We're going back to washing hair jokes again, aren't we? <laughs> but I really had a wonderful time with you today. I'm so glad you came. <laughs> oh, come oh. on, that date lasted all of three minutes. <laughs> okay, that happened to be once, but we never had a second date. <laughs> Rena, is something the matter? <laughs> Look, I put the deodorant on after I shower today. <laughs> You can tell me about it if you're having any kind of problem. I'm stunned by the fact that she's cutting our date short all of a sudden. Whatever it is, it must be something serious. Oh, no, 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 no. It, it's really not like that at all. My bunny, it stinks. <laughs> and now she's panicking again. She gets worked up over such little things. And I've got my trousers on. <laughs> it's all right, Rina. I believe you. Ellipsis. Thank you, Ryu. Right, that's just so everyone's aware we've done the ellipsis joke for the episode, okay? <laughs> Rena dashes off before I can even say she's welcome. I don't know what she needed to do so suddenly, but I'm sure she has a good reason for it. As I wake my way home, I savour the feeling of the warmth of her body in my arms. Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. Ugh. And they say romance is dead. <laughs> and I, just as a warning, okay, good quality microphones are useless after being drenched in spittle. <laughs> hmm. Oh, actually, look at the monitor there, okay? That's oh exactly the same picture as one of the backdrops of Magical Diaries. <laughs> yes. It's just been flipped. It's yeah. image flipped. Yeah, it's the same thing. That's what it is. <laughs> hmm. Guess the forecast nailed it this time. It's storming pretty badly now. Maybe she knew about the storm. <gasps> hmm. The thunderstorm warning remains in effect for Trident City and the surrounding areas until 2.45 a.m. 2.46, it's safe <laughs> to go out. Residents are strongly advised to remain indoors and keep the roads clear for first responders. Not to watch the Second responders, stop being so damn slow. <laughs> A flash flood advisory remains in effect for the Sakuragawa area and is expected to be upgraded to a flash flood warning any minute. For details, I'll turn it over to Jim. Jim, get out of that flash flood. <laughs> well, the situation is... <clears throat> sorry. <clears throat> well, the situation is worse than I expected. No, You're not, Jim. Not only is it raining, I've started to impersonate the uh, TV presenter. No wonder the weather report couldn't stop talking about it. I didn't notice. The weather presenter was cute. At least the weather was perfect early, uh, was perfect early in the day while Rena and I had our first date. Being with her was incredible. I can't believe how happy I am now. I'm still a little concerned by the fact she suddenly ran off, but I'm sure she'll tell me about it the next time I see her. Oh well. My God, he is so naive, mm -hmm. isn't he? <laughs> um, oh well, nothing says <laughs> Sunday <laughs> like surfing the net and playing video games. So true. <laughs> <laughs> yes, until the power goes out anyway. Yeah, a real gamer has a generator. <laughs> Ding dong. You think Reen is in a fight club? <laughs> Ding dong. Yes. Are we going to hear about Chekhov's flood? Ding dong. <laughs> Someone is ringing the doorbell frantically. Who on earth would venture out in this miserable weather? I dash over to the door and fling it open. Oh. Rayu, it's terrible! I still have my trousers on. <laughs> Rayo is on the door. Uh, Rena is on the doorstep, utterly drenched from head to toe. But the look on her face is such that I can't tell whether it's raindrops or tears coursing her way down her face. Rena, are you out of your mind? 
Are you going to catch your death of cold? Come here, take those wet things off. That's not important right now. It's Claire. Claire's boyfriend is... Me. <laughs> Claire's boyfriend. <laughs> Claire's boyfriend? What? Was there an accident? If so, then Claire, she must be devastated right now. Rena, calm down. Tell me what happened. Claire's boyfriend. He. And that's all we've got time for. No. <laughs> he. And stop laughing. Tell us what's going on. <laughs> he stops to catch her breath, but it seems like she's getting more and more agitated rather than calmer. Claire's boyfriend, he's... He's abusing her. Oh, God. I freeze for a moment. This is just too much drama. Wondering if it's like some sort of mad joke. Certainly, she can't mean abusing like actually hitting her. What are you talking about? Claire would never have dated a guy like that. She's not a pushover. I'm the victim. Mm -hmm. You don't understand. She's different around you. When it's just other people, she's nowhere near as assertive. Basically, nobody else generates that much contempt in her. <laughs> I can't believe this. Oh Christ! Really now? Aren't you worried that she might set us? He might set his sights on the heart of the gentle and innocent, or Claire, or Claire. <laughs> <laughs> Ryu, you have to believe me. He was calling her all sorts of names, and he even shoved her. She just stood there crying and didn't do anything. No, nope, not doing it. <laughs> I don't know what to say. I don't know if I can believe Why it. Why would she lie? Yeah, seriously. I don't know if I want to believe seriously? it. Seriously? Yeah, that's I'm, it. I'm going to denial. It seems to be this nice. <laughs> the pounding of the rain suddenly seems so distant in my ears, as if I'm in another world now. I try to confront her about it, but she won't listen to me. She thinks I'm too naive. Well, you are, but that's another story. <laughs> You have to help me. We have to save Claire from her boyfriend. I can't do this alone. Rena, are you positive that's yes. what happened? How did you find out about it? I was spying. <laughs> I saw them. <laughs> I was so shocked I almost fell out the tree. <laughs> you saw them? Where? That's not important, she has a reason. <laughs> That's not important right now, Ryu. You have to promise me you'll do something. She wouldn't listen to me, but I know you can do it. So please, forget about going out with me. What? Oh dear. What? Right now, you need to get Claire away from that awful guy. Do whatever it takes to save her. Even if that means getting her to go out with you instead. Rena, I've got a great idea. What about... <laughs> Today made me so happy. It was like a dream. But I can't be happy with you when Claire is in so much pain. So forget about being with me and save her. You used to like her, so I know it'll work out. It'll be fine. I'll be fine. You don't have to worry. I'd better get back now before the storm gets any worse. Yeah, sure. Borrow my canoe. <laughs> <laughs> Take care, are you? Well, that took a turn for what I wasn't expecting. Yes. Mm. Yeah, that took a turn for the bizarre indeed, <laughs> yes. Assess before I can stop her. I think the assessment that she's naive <laughs> is quite accurate. <laughs> and uh, living in the 19th century. <laughs> no. Your parents approve. <laughs> <laughs> How much is your dowry? Before, I can... Before I'm interrupted again. <laughs> Before I can stop her, she slips out of the door into the torrential downpour. No, no, gotta speak. Gotta go, go, go. Gotta say something. Go. <laughs> And by some strange coincidence, oh, no. we're just about hitting 20 no. minutes. Okay, we'll decide. Go after her or do I nothing. I think you should let them decide. <clears throat> yeah. Okay. 
All right, put it in the comments. Do we go after her? Or do we do nothing? Dum dum dum. Dum dum. Yes. dum. Audience participation. <laughs> Tune in. Roughly the same bat time, possibly the same bat time. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, I hope you've enjoyed this. This has been surreal. <clears throat> Interesting. Yes. Thank you guys for uh, joining in. I, I've been a blast as, as always. <laughs> okay, well. April's just like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, I think I enjoyed so it much than everyone, much more than everyone else, but. Uh, <laughs> so tired. Uh, <laughs> it was fabulous. I'm really liking yes. this. I want to know what's yeah. coming on up next. Yeah, it's, it's really. Yeah, two of us here going, I'm enjoying this. The third one's going, oh, we're getting paid for this. <laughs> I'm 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 I'm, cl I'm clearly sure that when, the, and the, when I wrote the contract, I said I wanted you to take the green hands out. I'm sorry. I'm... I mean, Sydney. Sydney hasn't had a part yet. It's got to ad lib. I'm so tired. I'm sorry. And I'm teasing you, and I'm sorry about it. All right, guys. Okay. Um, we're definitely over 20 minutes now, and I spent most of it teasing April, which I promised I wouldn't do at the start of this episode. So I'm really mean. <laughs> Alright, thanks guys, thanks for coming along, and thank you for watching. Bye. I've been Simon Parsons, these two have been the other two-thirds of the Minty <laughs> Trio. Thank you good and night. good night. Bye.